Hey guys, welcome back to my channel Automate with Rakesh. In this video, we are going to focus how you can remove the gray border around the cells in the Jupyter Notebook. Sometimes you want the cell of the Jupyter Notebook to take the entire space. So how do you remove this background gray border around the cells? Let's see in this video. Additionally, I'm also going to show you how you can increase the font size of this cell, the code that you write, how can you increase the font size, even that I'm going to show you in this video. So why delay? Let's get started. So currently, if you see, I have some gray border around these cells, okay, wherever I go, there's a gray border. Now to remove this, first thing you need to locate where this dot Jupyter folder is there. So usually it will be under users, and your username inside that you would find it okay dot ipython dot jupyter so look for dot jupyter i'm going to get inside this jupyter now here generally you should have a custom folder let's say you do not have a custom folder simply create a folder here i'm going to click on this icon and here i'm going to name it as custom okay so first you create a custom folder get inside this custom folder once you are inside the custom folder, right click and click on new and create a text document. And I'm going to name it as custom.css. Name it as custom.css. Okay. Are you sure you want to change it? Say yes. So now you have created a blank custom.css file. Right click on this file and then click on edit. This is going to open in notepad. Okay. So I have opened in notepad. Now I'm going to give you a code that you need to paste it here. I will probably give this code in the description of the video. So copy this code and simply paste it. So what this code is all about, it is going to set the width to 100%. The cell width will be 100%. So this is how the code will be written. And let's say you would like to increase the font size, then you write this dot code mirror pre font family monaco font size here you can increase the font size let's say you need 13 14 whatever you need you set it here now once you have put this code inside this blank custom CSS file simply close this and save it okay save and close it okay so once you have it look at your folder now in your jupyter folder now you have something called custom and inside that you have got a custom CSS file and this has got certain codes now, once you have this things done, all you do, go back to your Jupyter notebook, look at the gray icon that is currently there and look at the font size. Now, once that is done, simply close your Jupyter notebook instances, wherever you have opened and then reload it. You can see it is loading. Okay, so finally, when you completely close and reload, you can see the cell thing has gone and also my the background gray background is completely gone and also my text has improved. The text size also been the font size also been increased. So I hope if this video is helpful, please do give it a like and do comment that this video was of some help. So let's move on to our next topic.